You're watching New World Ordinance and today we're looking at the FEG PA-63. This is a semi-automatic pistol designed and manufactured by the FEG Army Arms Factory of Hungary. The FEG Factory of Hungary started producing Walther PPK clones in the late 1940s starting with their Model 48, which differed from the Walther PP only in minor details. By the late 1950s, FEG began making broader changes resulting in the PA-63, which uses a 9x18 Makarov round. It quickly became standard issue to both Hungarian military and police forces. Due to its popularity and relative durability, FEG later issued models using 32 ACP and 380 ACP caliber rounds. The military standard PA-63 version sports a two-tone polished aluminum frame with black slide, grips, trigger, and hammer assembly. While unusual for military issue in that a reflective polish was used, it was chosen due to its relative cheapness as well as a quicker build time. PA-63 sold in the U.S. are often advertised as PA-63 Makarov. This can lead some consumers to believe that they are purchasing a Makarov PM pistol instead of a different pistol chambered for the same 9x18 Makarov caliber. Though both pistols share lineage from the Walther PP or PPK, similar operating principles and the use of the same ammunition, the Makarov PM is a different design featuring all steel construction and different lock work. There are no parts in common between the FEG PA-63 and the Makarov PM. The PA-63 design reflects a compromise between police and military needs. The safety and decocking lever located on the rear of the slide may be pushed forward to disengage the safety. Aficionados of the John Browning designed 1911 or the Makarov PM may find this design unfamiliar although those with experience using more modern designs such as the Walther PPK, Beretta M9, or Sig Sauer pistols will find the safety and decocking leather to be located in a similar position. Overall, these are great guns that can be found at an extremely low price. You get an excellent value for the money. And we've seen many people use these pistols in our concealed handgun license class with no issues. You can generally find these for right around $200, so if you've got one for sale, maybe you're looking for one, you can contact us at newworldordinance.com. As always, thanks for watching, and if you haven't yet, please subscribe.